Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Crystal and in today's video we are going to be doing a cash stuffing for my savings challenges. And these are my binders and my savings boxes that I do for those. So I'm going to put these aside. And we're going to be working with my binders first. So the first one I, I'm going to do is my A6 Moturn binder here. And this is my New York shaped challenge here. So we're going to be adding 44 this week instead of our, of our normal 22. So just because I'm trying to finish it up quicker to use it towards something. So this is going to be 20, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. And let's see if we can switch anything out here. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, so we should have $836. So this is 5, 6, 20, 20 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 30, 35, 36. And that is correct. So we're going to be coloring in two spots this week. And hopefully you were able to see that. So let's put these back in here. Okay, next it's my daughter's sinking or savings challenges. So Brooklyn this week is going to get $10. So we'll actually switch these two tens for a 20. So she should have 85, so it's 20, 40, 60, 85 for Brooklyn. So we'll color in two. And then Emily, the same thing. We're gonna add 10 to hers. So we'll just switch that out. Or actually, you know what? We'll keep that and just add a 10. So she should have 85. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 85. So we'll color in hers. And like I said before, this is just, I combined my two girls savings challenges to make it a little bit easier on me to keep track of. And each one of these letters represent $5. So for my New York theme, we're going to add 20. Let me fix this. So 20 for this. So we should have uh, 180. So it's 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80. And I still can't find any of these stickers anywhere, so that's why I haven't been able to make any more. Now I had people ask me for it, but I haven't been able to find the stickers. And then on Amazon, they're so expensive, so I don't make envelopes really to sell anyway. So maybe it's a, I don't know, a good thing I can't find them. Because I'm always so worried that I will ruin envelopes for people if I made them for it an order so let's save money it's hard to see it let's save money we actually rolled a six and a seven so let's put that here six seven so we'll put so it's 13 so we'll do two fives one two three so we should have 103, so it's 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 1, 2, 3, 103. 
and this one is actually has a hundred spots here so this one's gonna take a little while that's why I try to roll more than just once I try to do like two to four if I'm having a good week it'll be you know three to four regular they'll be like just two so yeah so that's all for now with this one work out nothing okay and then my yearly mini challenges so since March did have an extra week I already actually did this one because I thought last week was the last week of March but it's really this week for me that's how I'm doing it so I'm just gonna fill in one for April and so for April I did 20 so my little raindrops here are gonna be worth $20 and I'm gonna do the bonus um, let's do 30 so 30 for the bonus so we are doing one raindrop let this dry because I didn't do that last week and it got onto my envelope so we'll add let's do one two three four five ten ten so ten fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty one and I'm still gonna switch put this in somewhere um, I think I said credit card and debt but we'll do that later by what I mean it's like split it up in half because I'm gonna put some in debt and some in cre uh, credit card so next it's gonna be our thousand dollar savings box and I pulled out the ones I'm gonna be filling so we have a 10, a 20, and a 20. So there's 20 here. And I've been doing it off camera, but I've been going and collecting like the smaller envelopes that I filled. So if I have two 10s in here filled, I'll take those two 10s and put it into a 20 just so the bigger ones can uh, fill up faster. So later on, you know, if I can't feel that much then at least I have I know I have fives and lower like low numbers to me is the five and the ten so put another 20 so yeah so pretty much I think all my 25s are already filled up since my box does have 5 10 15 20 and 25 so all my 25s I believe are filled so 5 10 me it just seemed you know it's the same thing you know it's the same money in there it's just switching it up so and so this used to be a little bit smaller but since I took a lot of the fives out now it's a little bit bigger but I can always do more than just one five so there's that and then my mystery box you can see it's empty takes the last of one the last of these one so it's one two three four five and I'm gonna see if I can just put fold it once instead of twice because last week it was just a pain in the butt to unfold all of them but we'll see if anything that I'll probably just have to open it and just fold it again later on so yeah so that's five there so I think that's everything oh so I made a cheat sheet for myself for my money box here my thousand dollar savings box letting me know how many I have of each envelope my 25s I don't have it on here because it's all filled up so five dollars I have 13 of them 10 I have 12 15 10 25 of them so yeah this is gonna help me know which number to pull for the week so yeah so that's going to do it for my savings challenges um if you like these kinds of videos please 
give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.